Two former eBay employees pled guilty Thursday to a harassment campaign against the publisher and the editor of a newsletter that was critical of the company, the Associated Press reported. Former senior manager of global intelligence Stephanie Pop and former intelligence analyst Veronica Zay, why is it both women, pleaded guilty after being involved in a harassment scheme that involved sending live spiders, a funeral wreath, and a bloody Jeez, Halloween Sally, pig mask to a couple's home. Reaver Barash, thank you for the eight months of prom. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. They're not very intelligent. They probably left their fucking return address on this shit or something. Like, holy fuck. Pomp and Zay were charged with conspiracy to commit cyber stalking and conspiracy to tamper with witnesses. Hold on, wait a minute. How is it conspiracy to commit cyber stalking if they were actually cyber stalking by sending things to someone's house? Isn't that not conspiracy? Isn't that actual? It's always women. The stalking became real. I need more water. I'm dying. It's so fucking hot. Conspiracy is just when you do it as a group. Ah, okay. That makes a bit more sense. Well, that makes a bit more sense. Their sentencing is scheduled to take place in February. Five other former eBay employees were involved in the harassment campaign, three of whom are expected to plead guilty to charges later in October. The harassment campaign began after the couple's newsletter published an article about eBay's lawsuit against Amazon, accusing them of poaching its sellers. In addition to the anonymous deliveries sent to the couple's home, they also sent pornographic magazines with the husband's name on it to the neighbors, posted the couple's address online, and advertised yard sales and other events encouraging people to knock on the door if the couple wasn't outside. That's fucked up. That's actually fucked up, dude. Why would you do this? And it's, it's not even that the women themselves were being slandered in an article. Uh, they just, uh, the couple wrote an article about a lawsuit. I'm talking about eBay. Imagine. Imagine guarding for a company this fucking hard. That is crazy. Absolute game journalist behavior. Why, why would you want to defend the corpo this hard? That's insane. The group had also made a plan to break into the couple's garage and install a GPS tracker on their car! What is... What is wrong with people? Gaming journalist in a nutshell. <laughs> you would defend me while hard, don't worry. Wait, what? 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 Yes, we're all Rhodesians and we'll fight through thick and thin. We'll make this land a free land. Take a wife who's a goblin, settle down on a gallery <laughs> to knock up our goblin wives, and our half gob kids will prosper for Rhodesians never die. Brave SJ, you had me in the first half. Thank you for the 555. Jesus. <laughs> Based Nimothy, are commies by chance? Because commies tend to simp for corpos harder than anyone else. That's kind of nuts to me. That's such a, such a weird fucking thing, dude. Sounds like a GTA mission. It does! It does sound like a GTA mission. 